really I think that having a career in the arts is, is like developing a thick skin. <laughs> uh, it's about um, uh, learning that failure is the way that you grow and never ever thinking about failure as uh, something negative. I feel like school can get really boring sometimes, and even though this is still school, we have more creative projects and stuff like that. And I feel like all the students respect each other's works and uh, give constructive criticism. ELE, everybody love everybody in the FAA. I've interacted with people that I probably normally wouldn't have, and it's just been a really positive experience. Because like one, because I feel that's the most. The teachers, one. they really like. They try to make it so the projects pertain to everyone. So I think they support everything that we do. These are kids who, who um, for the most part, were really unhappy with mainstream education. My expectations and hopes, you know, with the FA starting this fall, were that students would uh, be excited and uh, engaged in um, coming to school and in their learning. Which students succeeding in the classroom are the ones that will advocate for themselves, uh, the ones that will uh, work sedulously and will come and ask questions if they don't understand. We all sort of elected to take some of the honors courses and it's nice to kind of challenge ourselves and I think we've definitely seen an improvement in our study habits and grades. They have a lot of room in the FAA to to be creative, to express themselves. I mean, there is a major writing focus and I think that students are becoming more comfortable with um, analysis of the text as well as um, more comfortable with the rigor of the course. After the first quarter grades got out uh, in, in social studies, the kids were talking about um, how well they have done um, first quarter this year compared to um, their previous years. Uh, most Best of year of my high school career. Definitely. Probably ever. I want to come to school every morning. Yeah. It's his junior year, and we wanted to make sure that he was doing the right thing to go on the right course for college. She is now on the honor roll has totally changed her academics around and I am absolutely thrilled with the program. He wanted to take honors classes in all subjects. Her academics has been so much better. I know she's going to go to college. It's been a joy to see him so innovative with his schoolwork and participating in activities. The work is actually like really, really rigorous and you have to be able to handle a lot at once. It's still, you know, school, it's still your, you know, your tests, your homework, you know, everything, but it's a good balance. We're pushing out <laughs> that idea of, of uh, the, the artist going away and working alone. Uh, I don't think that we, had, we set out to consciously uh, change any rules, but it, it, was, it seemed like a comfortable idea that you could work together in other forms of art in the ways that these other groups of people work together. This has given them the opportunity to understand, you know, to even see himself, because I think he didn't even realize what his potential was. Our teachers, there's not a bad teacher in the whole bunch. I hated school so much last year. And I really don't at all this year. What, what's that? Can you say that loud? I love math. <laughs> <laughs> it just, it, I'm a lot happier this year than what I, I, I enjoy. I enjoy school.